Hey guys, happy new year, almost new year, and I'm gonna show you guys how to make honey rosemary chicken wings, cause that's what we're having tonight for dinner for the new year. So what you need are some chicken wings. You can get them pretty much anywhere. We got ours from Harris Teeter. And then you're going to coat them in three things. So you're gonna have some salt, some baking powder, and some paprika. So I'm gonna do that first. What we're gonna be using to do the chicken wings is called the Ninja Footy Grill. It's something that we got for Christmas. So we've never done this before. Um, it's the first time doing this recipe, so you'll see it in action. So what I just did was a tablespoon of salt, half a teaspoon of the baking powder, and then one teaspoon of paprika. So I'm just gonna stir these around. We bought about two pounds of chicken wings, which is about, we have about 14 pieces in here. So it's a pretty good amount if you're having some friends over. Okay, so normally what you would do is set these in the air crisp first, but because it's so loud, I'm gonna show you how to make the sauce. What goes in the sauce is some honey, and you can get any kind of honey. We just got the regular good kind from Harris Teeter. And you're gonna put a fourth a cup of honey. It's gonna take a second. Great. So you're gonna get a fourth a cup of honey. Now, it does say to do a tablespoon of fresh rosemary. We don't have any of that on hand, so I'm actually gonna use my Rosemary Vitality Oil from Young Living. And I am going to do probably three drops. I cooked with this the other day and did two drops, and it was a really good flavor for potatoes. So I'm gonna do three, just because we have two pounds of wings. So you kinda need a little bit more to get that flavor in. You're gonna need one tablespoon of fresh minced garlic. I like to use my garlic press. I actually got this from Pampered Chef and I really like it a lot. Um, I love cooking with fresh garlic, so anytime I can use my garlic press, makes it pretty tasty. And I generally put a lot of garlic in things. So when it said one tablespoon, I grabbed four really big cloves of garlic. If you're not as much of a garlic person, you can always just put less. But like I said, I'm a garlic person. <laughs> All right. Then you are going to put one teaspoon of crushed red pepper. Finally, one tablespoon of lemon juice. So I put honey, garlic, rosemary, crushed red pepper, and lemon juice. So that'll be a really nice flavor for the wings. And then I'm just gonna stir this up while the wings are cooking. Okay, so I have my Ninja Footy Grill, and what it says to do is to set it on the air crisp function at 390 degrees Fahrenheit, and you're going to cook the wings for 27 minutes. Now, you wanna cook them for 12 minutes and then open it back up and flip the wings, which my husband will film that in the video, but just so you know, and then close it again for 12 minutes to cook it. Then we're gonna take the sauce and coat the wings in it and then cook it for another three minutes. Since it's not super loud, what I really like about this um, is that you can use this inside an apartment. We don't live in a house yet, and so it's really nice because so far we have not experienced a lot of smoke. We'll see if this does it. All right, 
So now, hopefully you can hear me. Now we're going to flip them, and they smell real good. Okay, 12 more minutes. Okay, so we have about three minutes left on the timer. So all I'm gonna do is just scoop them in the bowl. Oh man, these look so good. <laughs> Probably the next time I'll do this, I'm just gonna say, hey, give me like 12 wings. These are 14 and we're eating them with four people. But it is pretty cool to know that like that many wings fit inside of all right, so I'm just gonna take my sauce and get it all in there. It smells really good. Okay, make sure I get everything. It's my timer. Take them out. Okay, yeah, I think I pretty much. Oh man, it smells really good. You can smell like the rosemary and the lemon juice and all of it. Oh yeah. And you're just gonna toss them very liberally like I'm doing. You wanna get all that good sauce and you're going to save the sauce to put on top of them when you re-cook them out. I've never done chicken wings before but I'm really impressed with how easy this is. And I'm starting keto next week. So this is a really good meal you can do on keto. Just gotta make sure it's low in sugar. Okay, that's probably good enough. All right, so I'm just gonna set these guys back in here for three more minutes, really to get it to cook in that sauce. And you can already tell it's like, sizzling and then probably since we're taking these to a friend's house I'm just gonna take the rest of the sauce and just drizzle it on the top when they're done um, probably what I would do differently is just make a little bit of extra sauce um, it is a good like portion for the sauce but I like a lot of flavor all right so just gonna close this up and done in three minutes so that took me about like 30 to 35 minutes super easy and yeah try it out also make sure to comment below if you like this recipe or if you have any other recipes that you want me to try out and make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel we have a lot more videos coming your way and if you have any other ideas of things that you want us to do whether it's with oils or our life or whatever it may be please comment down below because we really appreciate your support. So have a happy new year guys. Bye.